My name is Sylvie Bordeaux and I'm the founder and inventor of Muffin's Halo Guide for Blind Dogs. Muffin means the absolute world to me. I thank God every day that I have him in my life. Last year, we were outside in the yard and then I saw him walk right into the wall. I thought, oh my God, what's going on? The next day, he fell down the stairs. I was afraid that he might have hurt himself. So then I took him to a vet to get examined and then we found out he had a little mass in his stomach, which was very alarming for me. And then we went to the eye doctor, Dr. Farr, who's completely amazing. And I was told that he has cataracts and that he in fact was losing his sight. And then with dealing with the mass, I went to an internal vet. We had to do emergency surgery. And that night I came home and I gathered all his belongings. I cried all night. I was on my hands and knees. I said, God, please save my little guy and I promise I will make sure that I manufacture this product for blind dogs. We had a long three weeks, but he recovered nicely, and I'm keeping my word. When he first lost his sight, he was very timid, he was scared, he was depressed. Many people were saying to me, you know, you're going to have to think about maybe putting him down. I said, that is not even an option for me. So I explored, I experimented, and here we are today. The end results of Muffin's Halo, and it's changed our lives. Ever since, he started wearing Muffin's Halo. I've noticed such a great change. He's happy, he runs around, he is adventurous. It's like his little Superman outfit. He's very confident and I love it. So when I put it on, I know that he's safe. I think Muffin's Halo Guide for Blind Dogs is a good tool to help augment the life of our patients that have vision loss. They have to learn to move a little more slowly. They know they may bump into things. I'm in the middle of designing a whole line for blind dogs. I had the little angel wings for the small dogs and then for the bigger dogs, I need to make it stronger for them, for the impact. So I came up with the idea of having them look like little quarterbacks. I want people to order halos and have them donated to blind dogs in the shelters because they're the first to be put down. Most of the shelters around Los Angeles are high kill right now. They're killing 50 dogs per day on average. And a blind dog really is at the top of the kill list. Max was surrendered to Glendale Humane Shelter by a homeless person. He had one eye that was twice the size of the other eye. So I forwarded the photo to Dr. Farr. We found that he not only was blind, but he had glaucoma, which is, can be very painful for pets. He actually had a procedure where he had two prosthetic eyes placed and unfortunately developed a severe infection in his right cornea. So at that point in time, we made the decision that it was the best thing for Max to go ahead and have the right eye removed and the prosthetic in the left eye is doing beautifully. Someone posted me on Facebook, a friend of mine, and she said, oh, I've seen this invention called Muffin's Halo. I was shocked at how quickly he adapted to it. He bumped into things like he normally did, but it wasn't his nose bumping into it. It was this shield. You know, it was like having some kind of superpowers for a blind dog. My dream now is to have these little dogs in the shelters with a halo on, so when people come in to rescue, they're gonna get the attention first. I wanna make it trendy that people wanna go and adopt, foster, and rescue blind dogs. Look at this little guy. <laughs>